Today we are exploring this incredible abandoned chateau. There is so much stuff in this house. I've just found a hidden spiral staircase. I think this is a real animal skin. Wow, look at this room here. These look very creepy. exploring this absolutely incredible abandoned chateau now i've been told that there is some stuff in here which is going to absolutely blow you away so let's go and check it out and see what we can find so just walking up to the building now you can see how spectacular this is it is absolutely stunning now there is decay everywhere in fact as i was walking up to it i can notice that the the turret or the tower up there has actually started to fall over you can see at the top so it's not going to be long before that comes down. I'm going to have to be careful in here. There are broken windows, window frames falling out everywhere. Even the brickwork doesn't look very good. So let's go and see if we can find a way inside. Okay, so we're going to have a little walk around and see if I can try and find a way in. But look at this. Look at this massive pile of rubbish here. Has this been removed from the house or were they chucking this here while they were there? I don't know, but that is absolutely ridiculous. Right, well, I'm not climbing over that, so I'm going to try and find another way into this place. Okay, guys, we are now in this incredible chateau. And I cannot believe what I'm looking at right now. This is absolutely breathtaking. Oh, my God. Look at the architecture in here. This place is absolutely stunning. Look at the decay on the ceiling and all over the walls. All the paint's peeling off. It's, it's incredible. It really is incredible. I don't know how long this place has been like this for, but... <sighs> wow. Wow. Oh, God, I thought that was someone laying on the floor. <laughs> oh, dearie me. Guys, look at the stuff in here. Again, look at the decay on the wall. It's such a shame to see a building like this fall into a state of disrepair. And look, even on that side as well. But my head is spinning round in circles. What on earth has happened here? Look at that squirrel. This is so bizarre. Look at the creepy hand on the chair. <laughs> it's very creepy. I cannot believe the amount of stuff that's been left in here. What is the story behind this place? You know, why has all of this stuff been left? Why is the place falling apart? I cannot work it out. I really can't. And why have these been covered up with curtains? Is it to hide the stuff that's in here, maybe? Oh, my God. the amount of stuff that's in here. This is absolutely ridiculous. I cannot believe it. Again, we've got decay all over the ceilings in here. This is such a shame. This place should not be in this situation. It really shouldn't. Look at the chandelier. 
Look at the size of that chandelier. That is probably the biggest chandelier that I have ever found. That is beautiful. Look at that, we've got a real animal rug down here. Is that a, a deer? I'm not actually sure. If any of you guys know, pop it in the comments below, please let me know. <sighs> you can see how much land this place has got. It is just, it's breathtaking, it really is. It's like they were interrupted. It looks like there was a Halloween party going on or something in here. Look at those boots on the fireplace there. Do you know what? They're actually really cool. I like those. <laughs> Look at that marble fireplace. This is unbelievable. Oh, look at those on the chair in there. Now they are very creepy. I don't know if you guys can hear that. I don't know whether that's outside or it's inside, but it sounds like a music box or something. Could be an ice cream van, maybe. Look at these photos. Are these taken in here? Do you know what? I think it is, because I'm looking at the two curtains there. That's those two curtains here. That they, they were taken in this room. Wow. Again, stuff like that just blows me away. I look at the table all set up for dinner. That's just... Wow. We've got a massive collection of cutlery in there as well, look. God, the ceilings, the ceilings are just so beautiful. I can't stop looking at them. Another huge chandelier in here. In fact, the chandelier is all the way through the hallway here. Just look at them. This is one of those places that, again, just leaves me breathless. It's just stunning. It really is stunning. And look at this. Look how dainty the kitchen is. Again, it looks like they were interrupted for a party or something. I, I just can't work this out. All the empty bottles of beer. Look at that, the washing hasn't even been done yet. It's so bizarre, it really is. God, look at the stuff in here too. My God. Again, all those bottles of beer haven't actually even been opened. Okay, guys, it's now time to have a look upstairs. Now, if upstairs is anything what downstairs is like, I can, I can just tell you now, it's gonna be amazing. Wow. I mean, look at all the rubbish outside. It looks like this place was completely turfed out. I just don't understand what's happened here. It looks as if they just piled all the rubbish up down there and just left it. But why? Why has that been done? Look at this, what the hell was that? That sounded like guns going off. Ooh, creepy. We've got some mannequin arms and legs in here as well. Wow, look at that. <laughs> this is incredible, this place, guys. What? I think it's guns going off outside, but it's echoing right through this place. Oh, God, look, everything is still here. Absolutely everything is still here. Look at the ivy taken over that window in there. I'm pretty sure the floors are quite safe in here, so I should be okay walking through. Oh look, we've got another kitchen area. Maybe this was the servants' quarters, possibly. Just a utility room. But again, look how dated it is in here. This doesn't make sense. Some of the stuff downstairs looks quite new, but this stuff looks like it's from the 90s. Well, I'm glad that's empty. 
the same time, I would like to have seen a date on something to give me some kind of idea how long this place has been left for. God, look, the ceiling has completely fallen down in here too. That is such a shame. Okay, let's take a look around here now, see what else we can find. Okay, so this looks like it could have been an office of some sort. Got a typewriter, loads of filing cabinets in here. But be careful not to put too much personal information in here. But there's a diary here for drivers, which is um, interesting. And what is interesting, it's all in English. That's very, um, very strange. Again, just look at the decay here. Now, how long does it take for a windowsill to do that? If you're still living here, surely you wouldn't let that happen. Or maybe it just gets too expensive. You know, it's it's one thing buying these properties for however millions and millions of pounds or euros they cost. But once you have it, the upkeep, again, is a very expensive thing. You know, you could be a millionaire and have a couple of mil in the bank, but then you buy a house, you start buying food, you know, cars, daily jobs, and before you know it, the money's run out. And you're sat in a house that you can't afford to repair. Look at the ceilings in here. They haven't been decorated for, well, a good, I don't know, 10 years maybe? Oh, I thought I heard footsteps then. That was creepy. That was really creepy. I don't know where that came from. Wow. Whoa. Whoa, what was that? Oh, I think it was that paper on the car. Oh, fighting the life out of me. Whoa. Look at this, look. Deer hoofs for hooks. I'm not into that kind of thing, but um, I know they're not cheap. So we've got a WC here. Look at this, marble floors. Look at the tap on the basin. <laughs> Oh, the toilet is very disgusting. I can't show you that. Look at the mould on the wall there. Again, look at this. Look how dated it is in here. It's like walking back in time. It's really bizarre. Oh, this looks quite new. But then look around everything else and it feels a lot older. Hell of a lot older. And look at the cobwebs. Wow, that is a very, very big spider in there. That is, I'm just going to see if I can encourage him out. Come and have a look. No, he's not feeling it today, I don't think. But he looks very nasty. I think I'll leave him be. Look how faded those posters are there. In fact, look at the wallpaper in here. Look how faded the wallpaper is. Okay, let's uh, move on. Okay guys, let's go and take a look in this room here now. Now this looks like it could have been, I don't know, some kind of a sewer's room because there is material, wool, knitting needles, sewing machines, all over the place. Look at those photos on the fireplace there. Wow. I wonder if this is the lady who used to live here. Just look at the decay in here too. In fact, this is probably one of the worst rooms for it. Look at that back wall near the window. Wow, this is on another level. It really is. Oh, there's photos there. Oh, look, babies. This, this really does upset me. Oh, look at the dust on there. There's photos all over the place. Ah, oh, the dust is actually coming from this look. Oh, that's creepy. Sounds like the local rooks or the crows are nesting on the roof. <laughs> God, look, there's photos all over the place. Literally all over the place. Some of these look really, really old too. Okay, let's um, go check out the last two rooms on this floor and then we'll see if we can find a way up because 
I did see something very strange earlier, and I'm going to double check that when I go back there in a minute. But we're going to check these. Oh, look at that. That's another um, coat hanger, but it's got um, hog feet. Again, I'm not into that kind of thing, but it's, um, I know they're very expensive. Ooh. Okay, let's uh, go down here now. Again, look at the decay here. This is crazy. Okay, look in this room first. Now, this one's quite empty. <sighs> but the decay, look at the decay everywhere. Look at that, the radiator is actually falling off the wall there. My God. Again, look at the cobwebs up there. This is crazy. What on earth has happened in this house? <laughs> Maybe we'll never know. We've got another room here. Now this looks like a bedroom. It is a bedroom and it still has the bed. Look at that, it's still got the dirty stains as well on the uh, the back piece. And the walking sticks, or wood crutches, should I say. I wonder if there's stuff in these. God, yeah, look at that. Every single one's still full up. I can't believe it, I really can't. Look at this here, is this old medication? Oh my God, look at that. It's very, very old. Oh, look at this room, guys. Look at the decay in here. Oh, look at the tap as well. That is really, really nice. Wow. I've actually seen that in a few mansions back in the UK before. Look at the bath. Look at the tap on the bath as well. That is really, really special, that is. I've got another um, animal skin rug down there. I don't like those very much, to be honest with you. Wow. This is crazy. Absolutely crazy. Just look at the amount of land this place has too. Honestly, the boundary wall is probably the size of a football pitch, if not bigger. Okay, well, we've got one more area to look at now, guys, and that's upstairs. Now, when I walked up the stairs earlier, I noticed that there was another staircase, but it didn't actually go anywhere. So I'm not quite sure how we're gonna get there yet, but we're gonna go find out now, so let's go see. Okay guys, so this is what I was talking about. Now we've got the staircase here. You can see the staircase goes up, but there's a wall there, which is really strange. Now, the people who were living here, how did they used to get up there? Well, I know there's a hole in the wall, I've seen that. It's just very strange. Well, let's go and check out what's in here. Now, I'm sure this isn't how they were getting through. Oh. There is a stick. Oh, that's creepy. Oh, that is really creepy. <laughs> What's in here? Okay, so we've got a door here which leads to a derelict toilet. Oh, look at this. Wow, spiral staircase. Oh, look at that. It almost looks like a health skelter. Oh, wow, that is really high as well. Look, that goes right down to the ground level. Oh my God. That is so cool. That is really cool. But I want to have a look up here. <sighs> okay. Okay guys, so we're gonna head upstairs now. Now this is very creepy, I must say. I don't like this area. This, this area has got a bit of a a funny feeling to it for some reason, I don't know why. As soon as I've come up here, all of the hairs have gone up on the back of my neck. Wow, look at this. Look at the decay in here. And look at that, they've put a false ceiling up and they've covered that top window up for some reason. But look at the ivy, the ivy's made it all the way up here and it's slowly taken over the inside. 
Oh my God, the decay here. Look at the brickwork outside. There's hardly any cement left in that at all. That's probably why this house is still here like this because it's gonna cost so much money to put right. There's another hoof hanger there. I don't know if that's the... I think that's just wind. A bit creepy though. Uh, there's lots of little empty rooms up here, which is um, very bizarre. There's a very big breeze coming from in here. God, this is creepy as you like. What the hell? It feels like I'm in a completely different building now. Like, compared to what downstairs looks like, this feels completely different. Oh my God. Okay, I don't like that room. I'm coming straight out of there. Whew. Yeah, that wasn't nice. What is this? Why, why are there so many empty little rooms up here? And why is, ooh, that's creepy. And why does it feel like this is, well, just somewhere completely different? It doesn't feel like I'm walking around that massive chateau that's downstairs. It feels like I'm walking around, a, I don't know, like a derelict hospital or something. There's just so many empty rooms up here. Oh, look, this one's a little bit more interesting. We've got a broken crucifix on the fireplace there. Again, we've got a marble fireplace right up here upstairs. There's a magpie there. Hello, Mr. Magpie, how are you today? How is your wife and family? Hope they're all okay. Oh, look at that. There's a long way down. Again, that rubbish is very odd. I'm not sure they would have um, piled it up like that. Oh, look, there's a little bird nest there. No birds in it there, sadly. So we get a view of the other side of this property now. You can just make out the driveway coming down there, look. And then it comes around here, then down to the front. Show you a little corner, corner room there. And we've got a staircase here. Now, I don't know where this goes. Um, oh, it goes right up to a tower by the look of it. Oh, no, it's a loft space. Okay, do we have a look up in the creepy loft space? Maybe we'll just have a quick look. There's actually a room up here. Okay, now, this is the most scared I've been looking around this chateau. I don't know why, but this just feels really, really creepy. What on earth were they keeping up here? Oh my God, it's actually a lot bigger than what I thought. Oh. There's not a lot up here. There's not a lot up here at all. There is a ladder which goes even higher into the attic space. But I'm not feeling that today, if I'm honest, guys. This, this is actually quite terrifying being here alone. So I'm gonna... Um, Head back downstairs. There is another staircase up the other end. I'm gonna go and check that out quickly. And um, we'll see if we can find anything up there. <laughs> Fuck! What the? What? Oh, fucking getting out of here. What the fuck was that? <laughs> that was fucking weird. Oh, fuck. Okay, time to go, time to go. Okay guys, back outside, that was absolutely terrifying. I don't know what that was and I didn't want to hang around and find out either. Oh my God. <sighs> okay, well, I hope you've enjoyed today's video. Please like and subscribe. Please go check out the Instagram, which is the Beard Explore underscore. Also go check out the Facebook page. Look, always put all the pictures on Facebook, 10 of us from Instagram. Don't forget to check out TikTok and I'll see you on next week's video.